initially tried repairing this axle, sometimes you can cut a new groove in it, which I did with a uh, Dremel. But what I couldn't see without having this hub off was that the original line for the clip is way up here. And so I was trying to shave off, you know, several millimeters there, maybe five millimeters. And that's just not going to happen. But I couldn't see that. You know, maybe I was on the other side of the axle when I was doing it or whatever. But I thought I was cutting back into the original groove. What I was actually looking at was the last place the hub chewed the splines up on the outside of this axle. Yeah, this is supposed to be a nice smooth needle bearing inside uh, where the axle goes through. And this one's been run with the clip broken off the end. You can see that the needles are destroyed, the bearing is destroyed. And so uh, you can order that part right there and the new seal and maybe a new thrust washer. Or in this case, I'm just gonna uh, replace this with a good used one. I'm just degreasing this axle right here, gonna get it prepped uh, for new boots and new grease. So I've got the outer joint cleaned up, uh, the inner joint here ready to go. I've got my grease and my boots and uh, clamps and everything. Say hi, Tata. Ta -ta. Make sure that clip is nice and snug down in the groove there. You got this uh, retaining clip. Make sure that it's snapped into its ring nice and snug. That clip on the outside of that new axle secure. There it is. Thanks for all the help, Utah.